Hello, everybody. Surprise, surprise. Uh, I'm just doing a vlog right now, and then I'm going to do a vlog in a couple of days. But I've uh, come back um, a little bit to Blogging World, not much. Um, I'm going to be blogging about some things that have been going on, uh, some things that I've discovered, some things that I've discovered about myself, some things I've discovered about life, how those discoveries were made, um, kind of the goodness of what's going on. Maybe make a comment here or there about stuff, but not much. Um, I'm in a good place, um, although my health is is getting a little better. Um, it's still not the best, so we're still doing health stuff. We're just taking it a little bit longer. Um, I discovered I had a hyperthyroid, so um, I'm dealing with that right now and dealing with all the stuff that's going on with digestion. But that's stuff that just happens to people who have type 1 diabetes. It's not from being a bad person or from not taking care of yourself. It just happens because, you know, you have a disease, a chronic disease a long time. Stuff happens. And uh, so I'm taking care of that, but I'm not particularly worried about that. I'm just taking care of whatever I need to do, I'm doing, and I'm uh, making sure that I can live a long and healthy life and enjoy my husband. But upcoming in the next couple of days will be my 40th birthday. And uh, I'm really excited about turning 40. I know people may think, wow, you're turning 40. But no, no, no. I'm really super excited about turning 40. Um, I'm excited about the person that I've become turning 40. I'm excited about the person that I'm, I'm going to be and what the future holds for me and everything. So I'm excited about 40. And uh, 40 is looking good, I think, even for a person with type 1 diabetes and uh, a couple of, you know, health care struggles. Um, I've got a wonderful family. An awesome husband, uh, a good life, and it's peaceful. And you know, working out things, other stuff here and there, and stuff. But I'm learning a lot, and uh, I've um, I have become a lot more calm and uh, a lot uh, more peaceful. Um, there are some things that are still the same about me. Hey, I'm a Taurus, and I'm be a Taurus, and uh, so there's just some stuff that will be me and who I am but you know I'm okay and I'm accepting that and trying to live a life of balance and uh, you know but everything else is enjoyable and I'd like to come and I'd like to share some of that with you all on the blog um, you know I hear from people every once in a while and I don't really talk on other blogs much anymore I don't comment I don't do because I don't really want to argue with people and I don't want to debate stuff um, I don't want to debate about my life and who I am and what I, I don't really have time for that. I have something to say. I want to say it. And uh, and I'll say it on my blog. And if people don't want to hear it, they don't have to hear it. Um, but I'm not going to argue with people about the truths of my life and who I am, especially with, you know, people who don't love me or care about me. Um, so it's important. But it's important. I know there are people out there would use some of the words and the wisdom and the news and the discoveries that I've had for myself and uh, I want to be advocating even more for black women's mental health and uh, you know our, our spiritual awakening and for us to see more about ourselves and take care of ourselves and get the care um, that we need and make sure that we do some more self-compassion uh, for ourselves. So um, that's going to be a focus of what I am. But like I say, I won't be doing this every day like I was. I may not even be doing it every week. Um, it will be when I am inspired to do it and when I think I don't need to do it again, I will stop and, uh, you know, and do something else. But right now I just feel the need to want to say these things. And when I say them, you know, that, that's that's what I'm, I'll mean. It may make some people unhappy. Some people may not think it's in line with what they want for their philosophy. But, but you know, everybody can do what they want. Just, you know, do you. Do whatever you want. Do whatever makes you happy and stuff. Um, I don't want to really waste time talking about unimportant stuff. Um, you know, or, you know, I'll be silly and I can be fluffy um, and stuff. But uh, I really do want to try to make a difference where I can. And I think this is the way for me to do it right now. So I'm trying to get my health in order still thinking, I'm still tight. Uh, so, you know, I'm still happy about that. But other than that, um, everything's going great. Uh, I am, like I say, having a birthday this weekend. 
Um, my husband's having a birthday on Monday. I'm having a birthday on Sunday. And so there are two birthdays coming up. Uh, so we're going to go out of town and enjoy each other's company and spend some time alone with each other. Um, I've discovered as an introvert, uh, I really do like my time alone, and I like my time alone with my husband. I am not a crowd person, and I'm not a person that wants to do too many big gatherings or parties or stuff like that. Nothing against people, it's just that I like my time alone. And uh, he likes um, our time alone too. We're both kind of introverts, so um, we're spending lots of time alone, um, trying to make some plans, um, thinking about what we're gonna do in the future. Uh, thinking about um, are we going to move from where we live right now and uh, move even further north up to Mount Vernon, Washington, that we really love up in Skagit Valley and we love that place. So, uh, a little bit out in the, out in the country, but uh, but it's a beautiful spot and, uh, you know, figuring that out. And uh, he's working hard and uh, I'm just trying to get better and, you know, and figure that out. And just is kind of moving along. I'm just trying to take stuff one day at a time. I'm trying to live in the present moment. Um, do what I can. And when I can't do it, to stop and give myself some rest and relaxation. So I'm not pushing anything, uh, but I'm not shying away from anything either. Um, so it's really nice, though. And I'm excited about coming back and blogging again. And, uh, you know, I don't really have any many comments about what's been going on. I've seen stuff and I've seen people having, you know, arguments back and forth about this situation and that situation and what Kevin Hart is doing and what two dudes is doing making a video with, you know, some black and white lesbian stuff. I don't know. I don't care. I just, you know, there's more important stuff for me uh, to talk about and to think about. And really that's somebody else's thing, so I'll let them do their thing. And I'll do the thing I, I need to do, and I'll talk about the stuff I need to do. Um, but I'm ha more than happy, and happier and happier, to see more and more um, black women in, uh, in you know, in IR relationships, in interracial relationships, for those that want to be, and more women opening themselves up to that, more women having partners, more more women around me, more I'm seeing it, more and more and more, and more and more and more. Um, and I'm hoping even more that it just stops being this thing that you even need to talk about because it just becomes normal. And, uh, you know, so um, I'm loving that, uh, enjoying that. And, uh, you know, just wanted to just kind of let everybody know I'm back. Um, not at the pace I was before, uh, for sure. I won't be back at that pace. But I am back, um, and I've got a couple of things to say. And uh, I hope you enjoy hearing them. And if you don't want to hear them, oh, well, you know, that's fine, too. Not not a problem. <laughs> uh, you know, I, I'm trying to help people who want help. And I, I'm trying to, you know, reach out to people that want to be reached out to, you know. And uh, that's what I'm doing. So, you know, I'm not Mother Th Teresa. I'm just a human being, you know, trying to do the best that I can. And I'm not perfect. Um, I'm just, you know, trying to live the best life that I can live for myself and uh, make sure that I'm happy and peaceful and joyous. You know, that's kind of the goal. So um, I'm uh, happy uh, to be back and uh, hope to hear from everybody. And, you know, hope folks want to come back and comment and, you know, do whatever. But, you know, until then, until you get my, my blog about what it means for me as I turn 40 um, and, you know, and how wonderful I think this time of my life is going to be. I just, I don't even know how to explain it's weird, um, you know, to think I'd be dreading something like this, but um, I'm so cool looking forward to the time of my life. Um, so, but thanks uh, for listening, and I'll talk to you all later. You're here for me later, so um, you guys have a really nice rest of the week. Uh, okay, bye.